Well, this is then our second round one tie of Outside. the penultimate event of the weekend here at the Women's Series, and it's Maria O'Brien against Tracy North. Two players who are very capable, but we haven't seen the best of, I think it's fair to say, so far. North has reached this second round stage Bullseye. three times from four events, but has failed to go past it. Outside, Tracy's won the ball. And O'Brien has got exactly the same record. So one of them will change it here. And Colin Lloyd is still alongside me, still going strong, Lloydie. 60. Still going strong. We're into the second series of the day. If you're just joining us, Lisa 40. Ashton won the first one. Beating Fallon Sherrick in the final. Had the pleasure of having dinner last night 60. with Maria, Lisa, and Roger. And uh, very nice lady. Very nice lady. And like most of well, the ladies here, Merv, a ferocious competitor. Not here to make up the numbers. Yeah, it certainly is the case in elite level sport. Even you know, a lot of them, like you said, going out sharing dinner together, a lot of them good friends, well, but when it gets to game on on the hockey, there are no friends, as you'll know. Yeah, very true, mate. 25. Big opportunity for the, both of these lady players. Like you say, one's going to just go that little bit further than what they have done. Long 80. way to go. I don't think Tracy would be phased by Maria O'Brien, although... 83. Maria has represented England at international level on a good few occasions. Well, she did get a win against Corinne Hammond 85. in the first event. Defeats to the likes of Fallon Sherrick and Ros Bulmer since then. 25. Maria O'Brien, so... Yeah, all the women here will know what she's capable of. Tracy North has been a talent that's emerged in more recent years. The wife of the former PDC Tour card holder, Richard North. 47. Actually, former Pro Tour finalist, Richard North. 100. Hopefully he's tuned in to see how the better half is getting on. I don't think he's here because, well, I haven't heard him. Game shot. I was once called the mouth from the south. So Brian that takes the lead against North here. Double 16. Nice clean finish. Probably, probably actually played in Basingstoke yesterday. 139. One of the open events. It was won by a, another former PDC player in Lee Evans. 127. Well, she may have lost that first leg, Tracy North, but not phased by any of it all. 62. She's getting on with the job in hand. 42. Looks like she's using an old set of the original Phil Taylor darts. 100. From years ago. Is uh, Tracy. If it's not, they look very similar. 60. A very tough competitor, good player. I used to live for a while down in the uh, Portsmouth area, and there'd be 81. local comps on midweek nights in Portsmouth and Southampton, and you'd see Tracy and Richard at them. Simon Whitlock used to go when he was trying to. 100. Still does actually. Getting his practice, his match practice up. Andy Jenkins. Some really good players at those events. 59. It brings up everybody else, doesn't it? No, it does, mate. It, it, it's always good. Simon's always been one for playing in the local 60. comps. Keep, he said it keeps, keeps me match sharp. That is the Australian <laughs> Simon Whitlock I'm talking about there. I didn't know he was from Wales, but <laughs> we'll carry on. 
Willock has won his first match, by the way, of the day at the Euro Tour. Still in contention to book a spot at the World Grand Prix, but would have to win the event. What a shot this would be from Tracy North. We couldn't find the northernmost double. Next door neighbour. Can't be found by O'Brien, so a chance for North to level no when score. she comes back. Double ten then for Tracy O'Brien. Double five, and which she duly hits. That will settle her down even more. One all. A break back from the mini break. Now back on throw. And if you are 95. staying with us in favour of the women's series over the European Cheer event, We'll try and keep you updated with what's happened there as the day goes on. As I mentioned, 45. Simon Whitlock won his opening match 6-4 against Ted Everts. Brendan Dolan will take on Whitlock in the quarterfinals. That's after 100. the experienced Northern Irishman overcame Callan Ridd 6-1. And since then, the defending champion Christoph Rutajski has beaten Adam smith Neal 6-2. And Christoph Rutajski, actually, that was his first appearance in Gibraltar when he won it last time out. So he's still unbeaten on the rock 41 no doubt about who have been the dominant forces here four events 2-1 by Lisa Ashton 2-1 by Fallon Sherrick 55 who have now won seven of the eight events that we've had in total 95. in the women's series Dieter Hedman the other player to have won one a win that, of course, earned a replace at the World Championship last year. 29. A lot of people tuning in, Murph, might be thinking their sales was a bit of a procession. Those ladies seem to be cleaning up, but far from it. They've had to work extremely hard these last couple of days to get those results. Also, the other thing, the way it's been done, yeah, it looks like it's going to be one of those two earning the Grand Slam spot at the end of this six events, but it resets again at the start of the next six 41. for that race, and somebody else could have a really good weekend and bag that spot for themselves. So still all to play for. It's been an excellent response Before. in this match from Tracy North after losing that first leg. Yeah, she seems to have taken 81. control of this match at this moment in time, especially if she can take out this 50 here. Game shot. Yes, nice clean finish there. That will settle her down even more. This format, only best of seven. So she's halfway to the winning line. We do have a few results to bring you from the opening round here. They include a 4 2 win for Trina Gulliver, who reached the semi finals of the last event. She's Beating Abby Jurd by a couple of legs. Lorraine Hyde, a 4-1 winner against Samantha Lewis. Natalie Gilbert has beaten 60. Michelle Andrews 4-0. Tracy Davis, who we saw on the stream in the previous event in the quarterfinal, she's beaten Sharon Godby a 4-2. Corinne Hammond, a 4-0 winner 41. against Leanne Palmer. But it won't get easy for Corinne Hammond because Dieter Hedman is 3-0 up on Zoe Jones and they would meet in the second round. The best of the rest, really, that 41. pair, along with Rihanna O'Sullivan, Anastasia Dobromislova and Makiru Suzuki, who perhaps would have hoped to have had better weekends so well, far. Well, Anastasia's enjoyed a 4-0 birthday victory against Lainey Webb, and Makiru has beaten Joe Clements 4-1, and will take on Laura Turner in 36. actually what is this round, because that was a prelim match for Makiru. Eighty-two. Well, she's chipping away here, Tracy. She's chipping away a nice few shots. Nice little cover there on the on the nineteens. She's hit a decent shot here. Set herself up nicely. One hundred and forty. She does. That's a beautiful shot. That's put pressure on Maria O'Brien now with this one forty. Thirty-four. Sips have been 
scrappy visit followed by a good one all the way through this leg and indeed this match for 27 for Tracy North and she follows the 140 with another scrappy one can O'Brien find a good one double top 86 the tension just showed in that last start and North well, she'll aim for the 7 but she won't mind if it's a 19 she does get the 7 Maybe just needed to take a breath there. Yeah, through those darts a little bit too quick there, I think, mate. Double seven now for Maria O'Brien. Good marker. Six scored. All about composure here for Tracy North. She's got herself into a great position. Double three. Game found. Shot. A third leg on the board for Tracy North, <coughs> who is now one away from a win that would take her into the third round for the first time. Apologies, second round. I take her into. Getting 100. Carried away. But it would be a, a significant win for her, her best of the weekend. 41. Of course, she would have to get past the winner of our opening match, Suzanne Smith, 81. to achieve that last 16 spot. Well, Tracy's built herself up a nice little 81. lead in this, in this leg. As she tries to get through this leg, which would ultimately take her through to the next round. 85. Keeps applying the pressure, ton 81, 85. Raymarie O'Brien's going to have to start doing something quite special, and that might be the start of it. A nice little one-two-five there. He's got a right back in this leg. Forty-nine. We are going to see Trina Gulliver next here on the live stream. Semi-finalist in the last event, a ten-time world champion. Forty-one. Looking well, playing well. And she'll take on either Lorraine Win Stanley or Denise Cassidy. In the last 32 match. 100. That match has just got underway, so if North can finish the job in the next couple of moments, expect a, a break of 10 or 15 minutes before we return. 41. Of course, you will be able to switch streams and catch the action live from Gibraltar before rejoining us. And it could be done now. Double 16. 70. Well, Maria O'Brien here, she'd, what would she would give for a 140 here, Murph, to put the pressure on? Well, it's not a bad attempt. 84. Tracy's still got to go up and try and pin this double eight. Or double four. 12 scored. Well, it will be double two if she comes back. O'Brien hoping for at least a dart at the bullseye. Oh, now she needs to find a treble. Treble 17 will be the target, but she can't find it. 47. No score. A uh, big miss from Tracy North. Way back for O'Brien. Game shot. Uh, Tracy will be kicking herself there. That could have been... Like you said a little while ago, Murph, that could have been a huge scalp. I think she was just uh, looking over the finish line there before actually getting over it. Gave it too much respect. 41. But she's still in it, so she's still got a chance. 85. Yeah, well, Maria O'Brien does have the darts, but apart from the first leg, North seems to have pulled away in every leg in this match. 85. 60. Yeah, nice steady six there. 22. Two loose starts there from Maria O'Brien. She'd have been very disappointed with that. 
45. But didn't get punished by Tracy North. Another result just 60. come through from Gibraltar where Mensa Solivic has booked his place in the quarterfinals after beating Jose de Souza 6-1. 85. An average of 100. Well, maybe we are seeing a return to form for the Austrian ace. 100. Well, this is turning into a, quite a bit of a battle now, Murph. Tracy 44. North only one leg away from getting through the next round. Maria O'Brien hanging in there to try and stay in the match. 99. Forty-four. Well, can she force a decider? Fifty-four. Have darts to do so unless North can produce something rather special. Oh, got the first dart. Needed a bedfellow for a dart at double twelve. Seventy-eight. So excellent setup in the end. Double seven. 33. She'd done that a couple of legs ago, Murph, to be fair. She went double 10 and she hit the six. Double top for the match. Game shot on and the match. Finally, Tracy North. Tracy North learns how to solve a problem like Maria. Lucky. And wins 4-2 to progress to the second round.